Hey, welcome to Baz Studios on YouTube again. Thanks for coming back. The old familiar studio. Today we're focusing on pre-lawsuit Ibanez guitars for a change here. There's uh, my recently acquired 2375 Ash. The story for pre-lawsuit Ibanez goes that um, American Elger guitars was bought out by the Japanese manufacturer and Elger used to make handmade guitars American and then they started or stopped doing that actually and started distributing and putting together these Japanese pre-lawsuit guitars that were coming from Japan to the United States and the Japanese company had recently acquired the rights to the name Ibanez so they decided to start using it which later became Ibanez USA I believe a pre-lawsuit let's get into a few of the pre-lawsuit differences in these guitars here first I want to point out the truss rod on these this is for all three see that design what it looks like nothing like a fender that's how they were all cut we're talking, you know, 71, 72, 73 kind of thing. Big headstock. Maple. Black clay dots. Great frets. Ash body. My favorite I've been as here lately. Some differences. Pre lawsuit. This switch is a three-way and is uh, shorter here than your regular Stratocaster. Now also the other difference on this particular pick guard is its two-ply. Black on the inside, white on the outside. Of course I didn't get this guitar with the electronics, just the pick guard, the bridge and a few things. So I loaded her up with American Texas Specials and uh, she sounds great. Now the other thing I want to show you different is this bridge. This tremolo, the back of it, the springs, all that stuff. Have a look at that. The biggest difference you can see on the bottom there, I think I can get you to see that, is it's not solid. It's a bent or shaped piece of metal. And so that's the biggest difference. Also the Made in Japan light made in Japan words on the top of the neck plate had to do repair on this guitar neck joint repair so I found a system that worked great it's brought this guitar back for me because the neck was not good but it's brought back no skunk stripe big headstock typical pre-lawsuit tuning pegs Here's the actual truss rod cover for it. There's the plate. Two ply, black and white. White being the outside. Moving on to the Telecaster, there's the ashtray cover for it. Very different bridge. Right away, you can tell. Also, the output jack is right on that jack plate. Different, unique to these guitars. This one has a three ply pick guard, original electronics, original lipstick pickups, and we'll be back. <laughs> 